William Ruto has assumed the leadership of the Kenya Port Authority, promising to turn around the performance of the country's ports. Top on the agenda will be to ensure port operations are reverted to Mombasa from the Naivasha Inland Container Terminal and complete the ongoing expansion of Mombasa Port and the completion of Bats 3 at the port of Lamu. <laughs> After almost four years without a substantive managing director, Transport Cabinet Secretary Kipchumba Morkomen appointed Captain William Ruto as the 15th managing director of the Kenya Port Authority on Friday last week. Ruto, who was in charge of the Kisumu port, has been in the port business for more than 30 years. Today, the new managing director took over office promising to improve the fortunes of the Kenyan ports. Me, me, my rally call. Performances. <laughs> To improve performance, to let it be a share, to put a person zoe. Top on the agenda is operationalization of the second container terminal at the port of Mombasa, which was constructed at a cost of 32 billion shillings. Since it was completed in 2020, the new terminal has been dodged by disagreements over its management. The terminal has increased the port's capacity by 450,000 20 foot equivalent units to the current 2.1 million TEUs, giving the port of Mombasa an upper hand over other regional facilities like the port of Djibouti and the Dar es Salaam ports. While addressing members of the staff at the KPA headquarters in Mombasa, Captain Ruto said he will work with all players to grow the facility into an African logistical hub and a world-class port. <laughs> From Mombasa County, I am Anburu.